Hey guys, in this video we'll be going over the vaccination schedule recommended by the CDC in 2020 and some mnemonics to help you remember it. Before we jump into that, let's go over some of the abbreviations for immunizations. Hep A and Hep B denote hepatitis types A and B respectively. HIB stands for Haemophilus Influenza Type B, PCV13 and 23 for pneumococcal conjugate, IPV for inactivated polio virus, MMR for measles, mumps, rubella, VAR for varicella, HPV for human papillomavirus, RZV and ZVL, for zoster recombinant and zoster live, respectively, and PPSV23 for pneumococcal polysaccharide. You will want to pay special attention to the DTaP versus Tdap immunizations. DTaP stands for diphtheria, tetanus, and acellular pertussis. While the Tdap also provides immunization to the same diseases, there are important differences between the two. DTaP provides full strength doses of all three vaccines, while Tdap provides a full strength dose of the tetanus vaccine and smaller doses of the diphtheria and pertussis vaccines. Children under the age of seven are given the DTaP immunizations. Now onto the vaccination schedule. At birth, babies are given the Hep B vaccine. An easy way to remember that is B for birth. At months two, four, and six, Hep B, PCV13, rotavirus, IPV, and DTaP are administered. A way to remember this is 246B PRED. Influenza vaccine is recommended annually beginning at six months of age as well. At one year of age, Varicella, Hep A, MMR, PCV13, and Hip are recommended. VAMP is a mnemonic you can use here with the phrase, Vera asks mom, please help. Do you use any acronyms or mnemonics for remembering these vaccines? Leave a comment if you'd like to share them. At 15 months, another booster of DTaP is recommended and another Hep A at 18 months. At four to six years of age, DTaP, IPV, MMR, and varicella boosters are administered. At 11 to 12 years old, Tdap, meningococcal, and HPV vaccines. HPV is routinely given at this age, but it's acceptable beginning at age nine. It's given in two doses with a minimum interval of six months. At 16, another meningococcal vaccine is recommended. Going forward into adult life, Tdap, or the TD booster, is recommended every 10 years. Between ages 50 to 64, a zoster vaccination is recommended. RZV is the preferred vaccine for that and is given in two doses, which are two to six months apart. ZVL can also be administered and requires only one dose. One dose of PPSV23 is recommended for those 65 and up. Thank you for watching and if you enjoyed this video, then please like and subscribe and check out this video on nursing vaccine administration. Have a fantastic day.